I'm here with Dr. Romano to do a video on genetics. Hi, I'm Dr. Romano. I'm professor of organic chemistry here at Romano Scientific and the creator and the author of the Orgoman products in the Dot Destroyer book. I want to go over a really solid genetic problem with you. You can see a lot of good genetics problems in my detailed bio notes, which are free. If you join my study group, you can access these notes. As well as, I wrote up many new questions in our new issue of the Death Destroyer book. So come around and let's get started and I'll show you a really exciting problem. I wrote to you that a few forms of Alport syndrome was found to be sex link dominant. A child has two afflicted parents for this syndrome. The disease was given to the mom from the child's grandfather. What is the chance that this child will not have this disease, which displays kidney malfunctions, hearing, eye problems, etc.? Now, first thing, a sex linked disease, as you know, is carried on the X chromosome. And normally, sex linked diseases such as hemophilia, colorblindness, will be recessive. That will mean that a person needs two of those mutated genes to express the disease. But if you're sex-linked dominant, what that's gonna mean is that if you have a single X chromosome, you will have the disease. So keep that in mind, a single X, you have the disease. Now, I wrote down it's a child. Now the child can be a boy or a girl, so I'm not really asking you about boy or girl, I'm just interested in the child. Now. The dad obviously has the disease because it says there's two afflicted parents. So I'm gonna put a little dot. The little dot stands for the mutated gene. So the dad would be X with a dot and a Y. Now let's look at the mom. Now the mom we know has either one bad gene or two bad genes, but it says that the way she got it was from the grandfather of the child, which is the mom's dad. So we go back to the father of the mom, and the father, it said, passed this bad gene to the mom. So obviously, the father had to carry the bad gene, so the, or the grandfather of the child, um, is X with a dot, Y gave the bad gene to the mom, and as you can see, the mom is X with a dot and an X. Now, <clears throat> I wrote to you that in an X-linked dominant disease, a female with a single copy of the mutant gene, as you can see from this mom, would manifest the disease. So what I'm gonna do is simply cross the man, which is X dot Y, with an X dot X from the female, and we're gonna get X dot X dot from a Punnett square, X dot X, X dot Y, and X Y. So as you can see, all the girls have the pathology and 50% of the boys have the pathology. So I'm not asking about girls or boys, but I'm just saying if you're a child. So if you're a child, you better be a boy. And as you can see, um, one out of the four children will escape and be normal. So this child has a 25% chance here of not to have this pathology. I hope this helps and gives you a good insight on how to go about doing these problems. Okay, I'll see you in study group. Good day to you.